So we talked to Bruce about the race, but you were actually in the race. We, you know, it's Coach Bruce. Oh, sorry. Bob, Bruce. It's okay. That's all right. Yeah. And they, they make that mistake all the time. Yeah. That's hard when you have a guy with two first names. I know. Names. I know. Make up your mind. Oh, really? Bob, Bob Bruce, Bruce. Come on. Anyway. Now, now it's time to show you what I look like in a speedo. Yeah. Okay. Thank God I was using the camera. I was behind the camera <laughs> oh. shooting it. <laughs> I'm still looking forward to I, it. Well, okay. Let's see. Uh, let's see how I turned out. See if I was in the money, so as they say. Mention swimming, and most people think about pools and lane lines, and you know, an organized way to get some exercise, and even compete. How warm is the water? The water's not warm. But on a crisp, crystal clear morning up at Elk Lake, the swimming scene takes on a completely different panorama. It's what you get every year when you come to Elk Lake. Come on. For the past 19 years, Elk Lake has played host to the Cascade Lake Swim Competition and Festival. Open water swimming events of various lengths, ranging from a sprint of 500 meters to a 5,000 meter race, take place over a three day period. A lot of swimmers using the weekend to camp and play around the lake area. The lane lines normally seen in pools are replaced by the occasional buoy. So open water swimmers who can swim straight definitely have the advantage over those used to looking at the black line painted on the bottom of a pool. Operating room nurse Connie Schumann says these lake swims are welcome stress relievers. You've hey, done this before? How are you? Many How times. Are you? Good. Why? Good. Right, it's tiny? Because it's oh, my yeah, personal you know nirvana. Take oh, easy. oh, you go for it. <laughs> yeah, I'll go for it. No one can talk can. to you out there. Go for it, yeah. Oh, my son did it's that just you and the little fishies. Oh, did you? So it was fun for me. And, and, and too many people talk to you yeah. during yeah. the week. Well, I have to be politically correct during the week, and it's hard. So out there, I don't have to. But this is Sue White's first open water competition. Uh, a little some nervous? Some of you are going to want to... Not really. More excited. Looking forward to it. Point. With the water hovering in the mid-60s, some people choose wetsuits while others tough it out only in a speedo. All right, then high five me. You're done. All right, Kenny! In between races, the festival portion of the Cascade Lakes event was held, featuring the kids of parents competing over the weekend. The three-day event draws people from all over the Northwest, including Ben's own Lou Hollander, the oldest finisher in the history of the Ironman. How's it feel being in Elk Lake? Oh, I love Elk Lake. I come up here all the time and train. This is home for me. Yeah, I swim from the pier down there, here and back. Yeah, that's the day. Get the ice cream at the thing, and yeah, no, I love it. 